All right, good morning, everybody. Good morning. An RCT is a radiological control technician. I've been an RCT at the Hanford site for about 15 years. We head to the job. There's quite a bit of preparation that's involved uh, just getting ready to uh, get the people into the basin, verifying that the, uh, the basin is posted properly uh, for the type of work we're going to do. We put uh, individual lapel sampling devices on, on each uh, worker, so those have to be prepared prior to going in. We also run what we call grab air samples, and basically we're pulling air from the uh, breathing zone of the workers inside the basin. And, and taking samples, monitoring that, so we get those prepared to, to go in. We help out with uh, the PPE that's worn, making sure that things are taped properly, that the hoods are, uh, are, are good, and, and uh, the, the PPE is, uh, is worn the way uh, the equipment's designed to be worn, and then uh, we enter the basin. And of course, that doesn't, uh, that doesn't end there, because once we get into the basin, we need to verify the post. We need to start the air sampling that I was talking about, the, uh, the grab air samples. Uh, we need to get into the area prior to the workers to do some uh, swab uh, type surveys. We, we smear the area, uh, count, get results, uh, give an indication of uh, what contamination levels we're going to be working in. Whenever we're doing water disturbing activities, cutting, anything that might cause uh, airborne radiation, uh, it's, con it's considered continuous coverage, so we have one technician that's dedicated to that process. He usually has an outside person to collect his samples at the boundary, and uh, then he counts the results for him. It's important that an RCT knows what they're doing because it can be a difference between whether the individuals they work with uh, go home uh, the same way they came to work. Uh, and we need to send them home to their loved ones, the people that, that care about them and, and worry about their safety. I love this job, <laughs> I really do. The importance of getting the sludge at K Basin away from the river is it's just the environment's too important to take the chance, to take the risk of making it so that uh, our future generations can't use this environment. It's interesting and, and, and just a fascinating time to be working at Hanford right now.